A lot of things that we should be doing for our basic grooming are really anti-aging tricks. There's two of them I want to talk to you about today that you absolutely must be doing if you want to look the youngest version of you. First of all, you need to make sure the only hair you have on your face if you're a woman is growing out of your head and if you're a man is growing out of your head, trimmed eyebrows, and if you want to have a goatee or any kind of facial hair. And that's it. We start to lose our eyesight a little bit as we get older, but that does not give you the right to not groom your brows, to let hair start to grow around your ears. If you're a woman going through menopause and you're starting to get some facial hair because of the hormone fluctuations, you're not allowed to have hair anywhere around your face. None. You either get it lasered, you get it waxed, or you pluck it and just get yourself some bifocals so you have no hair. And absolutely, under no circumstances, are men or women allowed to have hair coming out of their nostrils. It is just nasty, and you look like the old woman or the old man that lived in the shoe and didn't have any mirrors on the windows or on the walls at all. Now, if you are a loving wife or a loving husband, you must be very delicate about how you approach the hair thing. You might want to just offer to shave your husband's or your partner's neck in the shower. It's kind of sexy. I've done it. I'm telling you. Um, and then you can just kind of trim up the trim, trim up the ears. But it is something that must be said because it is not acceptable. The second thing that is not acceptable is dingy teeth. There is nothing in the world that will age you faster than yellow or gray or dark teeth. Okay, it immediately says to someone that you're obviously not smiling, especially to yourself in the mirror, because if you were, you would see that your teeth are no longer vibrant. That doesn't mean that everyone needs to go out and get fake teeth, because that just looks just as bad. It looks like chiclets, and I, I think you should just work with what you've got. And all that means is getting a white strip. Now white strips, they come in paint on, they come in white strips. Now you can get a professional white strip. For $50, you can get 20 white strips. You can even go in on it with your friends because you don't need to do every single night. You can take six shades off of dinge, off your teeth, in one or two white strips. So if you just do one white strip for a half an hour once a week, you are going to see a gigantic, beautiful white smile over the course of a month. And that's only once a week. The one tip I want to tell you is when you lay the white strip over your teeth, make sure you take you know, a thumbnail or a toothpick and just get them in the crevices. That is imperative because you can't just have it white on the outside and it can be yellow or dingy in the crevices, in the nooks and crannies. So make sure you get that white stripe in. Those are the first two things that you must do, which is our basic grooming, to look younger.